Devin Breeze about to fire us off side by side with Ben Haney. And we will work out of corner number four. We'll get him side by side back to the green flag. Breeze slides up the racetrack onto the inside, goes Ben Haney. They swap inside, outside. Haney now to the inside. Still side by side for the race lead. We'll work out of corner number four. They'll drag race to the line. Ben Haney will lead lap number one. Devin Breeze up high, will slide back down, trying to get in that lower racing groove as Ben Haney has put a couple car length advantage now. Devin Breeze will drive it up to the back bumper, swing it out wide out of corner number four. Keith Welch in that third spot. John Pipe fourth rounding out the top five. Jared Moss. Breeze again down the back straight. He'll lose a little bit of ground. He'll drive it in way deep side by side. Out of corner number four, Devin Breeze working that outside lane. Will now lose a spot. Just about lost that second spot. Caution flag is out. And Xander Morrison, Brad Bain. Look like Alex Amon involved over in corner number four. We'll restart lap number four for the Rocky Mountain Dwarf car feature, Ben Haney. The birthday boy showing the way here early on. Long way to go to sell out this feature event for your Rocky Mountain Dwarf cars. Ben Haney on the low side of the racetrack, back to the line. Haney with a good restart will lead us out of corner number two. Everybody working that low groove, your top five drivers. Single file now as we work on the low side of corners three and four. Devin Breeze will swing it to the outside. Keith Welch within striking distance of Breeze. Battle for fourth. Jared Moss underneath the 05 of John Pipe as they work down the back straightaway. Jared Moss now into the fourth spot. Seventeen point seven second lap for Ben Haney that time by quickest one so far here across the speedway. Three second Welch still third Welch looks to the inside out of corner number four down the front straightaway they'll sell it off into corners one and two. Caution flag is out once again. Kenny Johnson Jerry Hunter on the front straightaway involved the 11 XX. And the 16R that will slow the field, we'll stack them back up. And we will work out a corner number four on the low side of the racetrack. Ben Haney back underway. Haney breeze, trouble John Piper around. Everybody will miss him so far. Caution flag is out for the 05 of John Pipe. And we will try it once again. Ben Haney back to the line. Everybody on that low groove of the racetrack. Alex Amon in a caution earlier in this feature event has driven about halfway through the field. As he's now working on the zero car fast Freddie Schneider. Good run for Jared Moss inside the top five, currently running fourth. Little pressure from that 55 of Andy Rogers. And again, everybody on the loose side of the racetrack. Devin Breeze will swing it wide out of corner number four. Ben Haney extends that lead over Devin Breeze. Breeze trying everything he can to reel in our race leader, Ben Haney. Keith Welsh solidly in the top three, currently running third. Although he's starting to feel a little pressure from that seven car of Jared Moss, 10 laps down, 10 to go this time by for your race leader, Ben Haney. Race leader Ben Haney going to catch the tail end of the lead lap here in the next lap. See if lap.
lap traffic plays a part in the outcome of this feature here tonight. Haney on the low side. Bree's been working a little higher exit out of both corner number four and number two. He's swinging it out, trying to find something to get, gain ground on our race leader, Ben Haney. Haney goes by Peyton Darling, as does the two car of Devin Breeze. He's closed the gap now out of corner number four. Gonna have a race for the lead here shortly. It's now just a couple of car length advantage. Haney now extends that out of corner number two. Working on the back of Frank Beck. We'll go to the inside of Beck, as does Devin Breeze. Brings it up to the back bumper, swings it out wide out of corner number four. Leroy Dilka tail into the lead lap and then a pretty clean racetrack in front of our top two drivers once they dispose of the 21. Oh, on the outside goes Devin Breeze. They'll have to cut back to the inside and regather it and try to run down Ben Haney once again. Good race out front, top four drivers have driven away from that fifth place driver of Andy Rogers. Getting in the later stages of this Rocky Mountain Dwarf Car feature. Ben Haney, caution flag is out, got a car stuck over in the bottom of corner number four. I believe it's the 23C car of Peyton Darling stuck on the bottom of corner number four. We will restart lap number 19, a green-white checker to the finish for the Rocky Mountain Dwarf cars. Can Ben Haney hang on and win a feature event on his birthday here at I-76 Speedway back underway for your Dwarf cars? Down the back straightaway goes Ben Haney, your race leader. Devin Bree's gonna have to make a charge here. Laps winding down this time by the white flag is out one more time around for Ben Haney. Battle for second, Keith Wells to the inside of Devin Breeze. Ben Haney down the back straightaway for the final time. And will lead us out of corner number four for the final time, the birthday boy. Ben Haney will pick up the feature win here tonight. Devin Breeze crosses the stripe second and Keith Welch Rounds out the top three for the Rocky Mountain Dwarf cars here this evening at I-76 Speedway.